Give me the fairy. I need. I need fairies. Give me a fairy. Give me a fairy. Give me. Touch the damn fairy, man. Talk about glitching through the fairy. All right, Sue. So, now that we friggin' have the friggin' frigger. Oh, and the clam respawns. That's not fair. That's not fair. I only went run one room away, and you can't. <sighs> I hate that, man. I hate games like that. You only you go one room away, and the enemies respawn, man. It's not fair. Hurry up! Hurry up! Hurry up! Hurry up! Hurry up! Hurry up! All right, one last thing to do: make the water high enough so we can go to the last friggin' part. Friggin' frig, man. Friggin' frig. Friggity frag freck of fracas. And we're closing in on that hour mark. Yes, we are. Closing in. Ah! Why must those enemies show up right when I get there? I wish they dropped some friggin' hearts or some friggin' arrows or some friggin' frig, man. What am I start saying frig for all of a sudden? I don't know. Alright, where the freak is the door so I can get on my level, ho? Oh, let's go all the way around. Yeah, that was awesome. Maybe if you go all the way around, you can show them the scenic route. Yeah. I don't even feel like commentating on this anymore, man. I've made this dungeon about as long as I could possibly make it. I mean, the only positive side is I haven't even died. Like, that's the only positive side. The only positive side. Now, I would rather not say that because not I the biggest my biggest concerns are actually over already. Fighting Dark Link, that was my biggest concern, no joke. I really thought I was gonna die on Dark Link. That's why I did this the cheap way, because I really thought I was dead. And I still lived somehow. <sighs> Whatever. Stop dwelling on the dungeon. We can reminisce about the dungeon when we're actually done with it. Because we're not there yet. We still have one more annoying thing to do. And that one more annoying thing... ...lies on the other side of this door. If I could aim. Learn how to aim, dude. Oh my god. Oh my god. Please tell me that's good enough. Thank you. Oh god. I can't aim. Inverted controls are the death of me. Alright, so this room, while it can be quite annoying, if you time it right, if you play your cards right, like right now, play your cards right, play your cards right, play your cards right, and victory! Oh, what? Oh, you're kidding me. You're kidding me. Oh, are you kidding me right now? What am I doing? I'm gonna... <sighs> Hold on. Dude, I had it. First try. It was mine. This world was mine for the taking. Make me king. Give me this. Give me the fairy. I want to be in there full hearts. I'm not going in the boss without full hearts. I'm just not. It's not gonna happen. Alright, um, yeah, we're gonna try that again. Usually I get this on the first try. What the hell, man? I had the timing. It was perfect. My timing was impeccable. There it is. There it is. There it is. We got this. We got this. Alright, time to fight the boss. Are you guys ready for this? Because I'm certainly not. And the only way to trigger this boss fight... Yeah, I'm aware. Not normal water. Mega Man, Mega Man. That water is blue. Water isn't supposed to be blue, is it? Actually, it's not. Scientific fact. Another cool intro to a boss. At first, you're thinking, man, what the fuck is this going to be? This is going to be like a shark or some shit. It's going to be some crazy-ass fish. Some octopi. No? Not? What is it going to be? Whatever it is, it's looking at me. Stop looking at me. And then you... Link, turn around! It's behind you! What the fuck? What the f- What the f- What the hell is that? Is that Chaos from Sonic Adventure? Cause that's what it looks like. Cause that's what you look like, sir. 
You look like Chaos from Sonic Adventure. Anyway, I I refuse to go in the middle of this place and fight. I refuse. It's like the, it's a death wish. If you if you go if you try to go in the middle and fight this guy, it's just a death wish. It just is. What? How did that not get him? Get him. Oh, wasted. Well, to be told, this boss isn't terribly hard, but it can be quite annoying to get hits on him while not getting hit. Because the biggest thing is getting him in range, meaning grabbing him with the long shot. And honestly, I know no better way than to do it the way I'm doing it right now. Uh, you know, I'd ask for tips, but what would be the point, you know? I don't know how many hits he takes, and I don't know if he dies faster if you do a jump chop, jump strike, whatever. Come here, you bastard. What the hell? I couldn't grab him. Couldn't grab him. Please grab him. Alright, run away. Run away. Run away. Run away. Run away. There's another one. I see it. I see it. It's gonna hit me. It's gonna hit me. It tried. It tried its damnedest. Get that good... Good lord, man. Couldn't grab that fool. Holy crap. How did I not get grabbed right there? How did I not get grabbed right there? I'll thank my lucky stars for that one. Oh my god. Okay. Come on. We got this. We got this. Move. Grab him. What the hell, man? You can't grab him from there or what? Man, we are making incredible amounts of leaps and bounds on this. Be truth, truth be told. Move, 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 move. That tentacle is gonna grab you. I forget how many tentacles you can have at once, but your best bet is to just keep on fucking moving around. Oh, he grabbed me! No, 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 no. Am I gonna live? Am I gonna survive? Oh crap! Get out of the water! No, get out! Oh! One grab and he killed me. Seriously, one grab. Oh my god. I freaking was doing so good, too. Oh. <sighs> you guys have no idea right now. I'm trying to decide if I even want to talk anymore. Like, seriously, that, I can't believe that just freaking happened, man. Like, it's one thing that he hit me at all. But one flurry of attacks and I'm dead? That wasn't even fair. That's just not fair, man. Like, I seriously can't even express my fucking anger right now. It's just, that was the worst possible scenario. I, like, do that well, get hit once, and just die. Yeah, suck on that. Jump strike his ass. Whatever. I'll just wait till I have an easy easy uh attempt at it. Like right here. Just should be perfect. Ah, oh, not close enough, I guess. Grab him. Oh my god. Seriously, what the hell, man? Hit him! He's right there! Oh man. Uh I don't even want to talk. If I don't talk anymore except for the complaints I have when I get hit, 
sorry, it's just how it's going to be for the rest of this boss fight. Because seriously, I'm not a happy camper right now. Did I hit him? I don't think I hit him. No. Get out of the water. I didn't mean to fall in the water. It was an accident. It was an accident. Go away, amoeba. I hate you. Get off of here. Get off of here. Get off of here. Run like hell. No! 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 Oh, man, there's nothing you can do about this either, man. Just get off of this fucking platform. Oh my god, okay. Alright. We've put up we've we've made some space for ourselves. It'd be amazing if we could reach him from here, wouldn't it? Oh it was amazing. It was amazing. Move, move, move. Move, move, move. More tentacles. Uh, how many tentacles can he have at once? Just two, hopefully? Oh, you bitch! Oh my god. Oh my god. Run away. Come on, I was hoping that was the last hit. He's got to be close. Seriously? He's got to be. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Don't stop moving. Oh, man. Oh, man. Sorry, I can live that I didn't get him right there. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Don't stop, don't stop, don't stop. Keep moving, keep moving, keep moving. Even though I can't see shit, and I know where he is. Come on, right now. Nope. Yes! You fuck! Oh, man. I can't believe that even. Ugh. <gasps> Sigh of relief. Sigh of relief. The part of the game I dreaded the most is now complete. And I did the whole thing with only one death. If I had somebody here to give me a high five right now, I would so high five them. Oh, you mean you'll high five yourself? Do it. Yeah. Yeah, I just high five myself. Narcissistic, lame, or awesome. Or just sad. I'm going to go with sad. Um, where's the heart at so I don't accidentally get it? I don't want to accidentally get the stupid heart. Whatever, let's just head straight for the teleport. Not, I won't accidentally get the heart if I just go for the teleport. Oh my god, guys. Oh my god. I don't even, uh, I don't even, words cannot express. Words cannot fucking express. And I'm sorry it took me that long. I, am, I apologize to no end. 
Not even just that boss. Just the whole dungeon. Because, good lord, I'm looking at my time right now. I am over an hour. Over. Over. Yeah, we know who the sage is. Come on. Seriously, if you didn't think you were going to be the sage, then what the F, man? Surprise, surprise, really? I would have expected no less from the man I chose to be my husband. Zora's domain and its people will eventually return to their original state. See, one thing about Zora's domain I've always found annoying is that it doesn't actually get unfrozen. Like, you go back there after you beat this, it's still frozen, man. What the hell? I thought you saved Zora's domain. It's like, oh, after you beat Ganon, it'll go back to normal. It's fucking ridiculous. You can't hide anything from me. Okay, Miss, Miss Know-It-All over here can sense what Link is thinking, I guess, because she's just so genius. I can tell you that nothing will stop you in your quest for justice and peace. You must take this medallion respectfully. What if I take it disrespectfully? Like, fuck you, give me your medallion, bitch. No? Alright, fine. Ah, give me your pointless piece of blue, blue coin so I can go on without you. And never have to speak to you again. You receive the water medallion, Rugo, Xmas Sage, and Agile Power to yours. Alright, guys. That's three dungeons down. Or three temples down. That's not three dungeons. I've already done more than three dungeons. Three temples down. And I'm sorry that that one took that long. And, oh, good lord. What was that? What was that? Four videos? Yep. It looks like that was four videos. <sighs> Aftermath here. We get to watch the lake fill up. That's the only real gratification you get for beating the water temple is the Lake Hylia goes back to normal. But Zora's Domain doesn't go back to normal. It's kind of sad, actually. Well, we get to say what's up to Sheik real quick. Like, what's up, Sheik? How's it going? Did Ruto want to thank me? I see. We have to return peace to Hyrule for her sake, too, don't we? Oh, just her. Yeah. Look at that, Funky G. Together, you and Princess Ruto destroyed the evil monster. Once again, the lake is filled with pure water. All is as it was here. And for those of you who might be thinking, is he going to get the fire arrows? No! I'm not going to get the fire arrows. You don't need that. You don't need that. I'm not. I'm really not. Yeah, yeah. Hurry up, she can just shake me and bake me real quick so I can just end this episode already. Man. Like, these people haven't watched me play enough today. I think you guys have had about just about enough of me as... Just as much as I've had enough of myself. So, yeah. <sighs> well. And we're still beeping. We could definitely use a heart right about now. Is there a heart? Give me a heart. Give me a heart. There you go. I feel better now. Now that we got a heart and I'm not beeping anymore, I'll leave you guys right here in Lake Hylia. And next time on Let's Play Ocarina of Time 3 Heart Run, we will head to the next temple, which is the Shadow Temple. I don't know if we're going to actually do it next episode, but we'll start making our way there. Anyways, until tomorrow, peace.